this is our uh, course differential equations so the first part is that we understand that differential equations are there for us it's just a tool just like an app you use an app to do certain things just like that differential equations are there and we can model the physical or otherwise related behaviors with respect to space or time so although this course is mathematic intensive and mostly we'll be doing maths but the spirit behind all of that is that we would like to model physical quantities using mathematics which is differential equation in this case and then we would like to retrieve some information about that physical system using those mathematical equations which are differential equations so in order to retrieve that information we would like to solve the differential equations using uh, standard mathematical procedures like integration differentiation uh, which leads me to uh, a very important point which must be mentioned and that is that you should have sufficient knowledge from calculus you should know how to differentiate algebraic equation or how to uh, integrate an algebraic function because these are two things which are frequently done in this course i expect that you know both of these things and how to manipulate logarithms or exponents or because all of these things are covered in the previous course which is calculus the textbook is differential equations with boundary value problem and we will have quizzes and we will have assignments and i'll be doing online lectures and i will also be recording the lectures and i will be sending you links to those lectures this is the book differential equations by zill and kalen so you would immediately see that the first page of the book is review of differentiation this is kind of a a help sheet kind of thing that you should always keep on your side second page brief table of integral right the book is very well written in my opinion so easy to read but sometimes the explanation may not be that obvious uh, so that's that's where i come in and uh, i'll be trying to make sense of that text as much as possible because we have to read between the lines and there there is so much that needs to be read between the lines this, uh, in this course and similarly just to keep yourself motivated always tell yourself what we are doing is that this thing represents a physical model like for example if you're standing on a building and you throw a stone to, towards the ground all of this process the which leaves this point and reaches this point the distance of this stone from the starting point is modeled using this equation y double prime equal to g so y double prime is the thing which makes this equation a differential equation and where did this differential equation come it came from the modeling of a physical process of a stone falling from top of a building and reaching down to the bottom of that building 